Now my first job was at Sears, and whenever I turned my money in, it was a green bag. Man, this is when I was like 18. I, it was just like this, just now after high school. And in the spirit, I was picking up trespassing upon my citizenship. Okay, then the story goes on, going on. I'm 37 now, that's when I was 18. First job was at 18. Uh, just graduated um, 1994. And that summer, I picked up a job the following school semester, which was my freshman year in college. Now, on the front of the campus, I had this envision of Michelle putting in my hand a yellow cross. When I was a little kid, still in elementary, my, my mother, she called me in one day early, and she said, real, sit down, and we have to talk about your future. And as I was sitting down, there was a yellow star that you put on the... Um, on top of the um, the album that spin way back there, the third, I just was talking to a guy the other day about it. So I had this little poetry from this yellow star to this yellow cross I went to. My mother gave me this yellow star, and Michelle came in the spirit in 1994 and gave me this yellow cross. Then there was this one month fraudulent marriage, and then the spirit, as if her spirit was ministering, I received it was for how the Holy Ghost do things, was ministering about what the White House see when they look at my life. Versus when just the ordinary side of life looks at my life. Not saying ordinary, just like looking down on people, but I have a couple envisions what the Lord is teaching me. Um, come to Christianity in the White House looking at what I'm doing with your life. It's, it's a different picture. It's more of a, a successful, it's like a blowout come. I mean, I'm not to, not to, uh, not praising myself, the Bible says don't praise yourself, but I, I can comprehend when the Lord is sustaining we can, we can go over on this and check out Joseph and everything. Big difference though, I have this story, I probably write a book about it. When your life could be over here experiencing this, that it, God put it in the earth to inspire and that's what it's doing. Then for it to be over here and that's not being picked up, that that's what your life is doing and inspiring. So you're not going to get that. The Bible speaks about the prophet um, and the gentleman's here. Um, in his hometown, he gets a little on it. But then the Lord also talks about there's still some things he can do, it's just not gonna be that much, you know. And then